the Melrose Hotel, formerly known as the Barbizon Hotel for Women, which catered to well-bred young women getting a start in Manhattan, was acquired in May 2001 by the Melrose Hotel Company. For most of its existence, no men were allowed above the ground floor and strict dress and conduct rules were enforced. The hotel became a more standard hotel when it began admitting men as guests in 1981. In 2002, a $40 million renovation was completed and the name was changed to the Melrose Hotel. The goal of the renovation was to recapture the original opulence of the 75-year-old hotel at 63rd Street and Lexington Avenue. Optimum Window Manufacturing was not only able to match the old-style windows and bring them up to date, but they were also made environmentally friendly by using recyclable green steel. As you can see in these photos, these were just a few of the many shapes that went into the restoration of this great building. In order for the new Melrose Hotel to maintain its Italian Renaissance neo-Gothic style, the project manager had to find a company that was noted for its ability to work with steel windows, thus the reason why Optimum Window Manufacturing was chosen. Cachet is nothing new to the Melrose Hotel Company, a subsidiary of the Berwyn Property Group, which has $2.5 billion in assets. Though Melrose, which is based in Philadelphia, is a relative newcomer to New York, it already owns three other luxury hotels in Dallas, Washington, and Columbus, Ohio. Still, the company is trying to appeal to a particular slice of the luxury market, one where comfort and service reign over trendiness, says John J. DePaul, the president and chief executive of the company. For more information, please visit www.optimumwindow.com.